everyone, and we're back. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I am here with some Dragon Age Origins, and Alistair wanted to get in my face. Let's go. We have to go see the assembly. Wait, since I said no to Augur there, I'm gonna have to walk all the way back. Well, fuck you too, game. What kind of conversation can we have when we're walking around like this? Um, saving content. Why are you saving content? There shouldn't be anything left. Let's see here. Let's have a conversation about. Um. Ooh, stone golem. Let's have a conversation about not putting your friends into giant stone golems. It's not very nice, and it's probably rather painful. And they, and you know, having a control rod over your friends and other people is not very nice. Ooh, another stone golem. And it is kind of a form of, form of really bad slavery. Shale probably would not appreciate it. In fact, if you have Shale in your party when you're there, if you side with Bronca, Shale attacks you. <laughs> and we like Shale. We don't want Shale attacking us. And this walk is going to be very, very long. So I'm just going to blabber on and 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 on. Genlock. I'm gonna take that. On and 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 on. That stopped being a word after a while. And that's where Bronca was. Now we're going through the camp. You know, the place where Bronca killed her entire house. Or at least got them killed. By throwing them at traps instead of trying to figure out how to get around them. I mean, I got around all the traps just fine. Maybe you should have had a rogue. Rogues are awesome. They do it from behind. Step, step, steppy, 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 step, 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 step. There we go, deep roads. Let's go here. To Ulzama! Because we have to talk to the assembly. Oh, I'm going to regret this. Stretch. Stretching is good for you. Very, very, very good. And it's also very cold in here for 10 o'clock in the morning. Why am I recording at 10 o'clock in the morning? Oh, hi. Lords of the Assembly, I call for order. This argument gets us nowhere. Then why these delaying tactics? BT I guys. call for a vote right now. My father has one living child to assume the Idukan throne. Who would deny him that? Your father made me swear on his deathbed you would not succeed him. I apologize for the interruption, Lord Steward, but the Grey Warden has returned. Hi. I have news. Well, Warden, where's the what crown? Is it in her butt cheeks? Um, I bear a crown from Paragon Caradan for his chosen king. Caradan was trapped in the body of a golem. This Warden granted him the mercy he sought, releasing him and destroying the Anvil of the Void. Before he died, Caradan forged a crown for Orzammar's next king. Damn straight chosen he Chosen by the ancestors themselves. I would like to believe Ogren's word, but it's well known the Grey Warden is Balin's hireling. Yep. Silence! This crown is of Paragon make. How can you tell? House Ortan's ancient seal. Oh. <laughs> tell us, Warden. That'll help. Whom did Caradan choose? He went- okay. If it was me, I would just say Caradan chose Balin, so I could stop them from being angry. But Yue is truthful. She, he wished me to give it to whomever I choose. Why would a paragon trust someone who knows nothing of us with such a decision? Because he doesn't give this a fuck? This is preposterous. We've argued in these chambers for too long. The will of the paragon is that the Grey Warden decide. Oh, I can give it to Haramont. <laughs> Let's give it, uh, Balin. At last, this farce has ended, and I can take my rightful place on my father's throne. Yay! I don't really like Balin, but all things considered, he seems to have the more open-minded opinion, even though this is probably going to come back to bite me in the ass in later games. Because he is kind of a dick.
Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's get that crown on your head. Nice armor, though. <laughs> they are making no sounds when they do that. Let the memories it's like their staves are made of marshmallows. First amidst the lords of the houses, the king of Orzammar. Dun dun dun! Why did he teleport Do the other direction? you acknowledge me as king? I cannot defy a paragon. The throne is yours, King Balin. Then as my first act as king, I call for this man's execution. Excuse me, what? <laughs> Guards, seize him! That is hot. Yui looks really pretty in HD. Sorry, what? Um... Harrowmont was an honorable rival. Let him retire in peace. You know better than anyone the war facing us, Warden. Orzammar cannot afford to be divided. Anyone undermining my reign is serving only the Darkspawn. I will return to my palace to gather my generals and prepare our I forces I wonder if Harrowmont would have killed Balin. I will see you there, or if Balin Warden. would have just attacked. You have my gratitude for all you have done for me. Mm, I'm not okay with that. Banish him to the surface, maybe, but don't kill him. It's not very nice. Well, we have a king for Orzmar, and we've got the, we've got the, uh, the dudes. Now we just have to get the elves. Uh, okay. The elves don't take too long. I don't think they take as long as freaking Orzammar does. Orzammar takes forever. You have proven yourself and I, more, Balin. Your Without your aid, I would not have taken armor. this throne so smoothly or so soon. Throne belongs. Mm. I don't agree with any of these. Uh, the throne belongs to the House Iduken. As all in Orzammar now see, my generals are already preparing for a mission to the surface. Good. When you have need of us, you shall have every able-bodied dwarf in Orzammar. Good. Since you did more than I expected, I offer a personal reward as well. Oh damn it! This was a maul favored by my brother Trian. Take it with you as a reminder of your ties to Orzammar. Now, I have much to do. If there is nothing else... Um, I'll take that as a thank you. I want my face on one of those big statues. Um, I will return to the thir service. Thank you for your aid. Good luck, Warden. May we both crush our enemies. <laughs> that doesn't sit well with me. Oh well, it's out of sight, out of mind. Let's go talk to the elves after we do things in the party camp. Because we still have Ogren to talk to. We haven't done our introductory talking to of the Ogryn yet. What is that? Whiff of warding. <laughs> this one. Um. Oh, it's a land of people. Oh, well, I'll get out of your way then. Diamond quarter. I hope that we can make Ogren like me, especially because I'm going to have to, um, import all of my, uh, import stuffs into Origin- or Origins? Awakening! Import things into Awakening form because of the stupid glitches! I love glitches, just not when they're silly and, and, and dumb. Save, 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 save. Grey Warden, it? you have impressed the- Oh, hi, Cardle! The hell are you doing here? If I'd heard it secondhand, I'd have called it a sodding lie. Warden, we've got a king because of you. Yep. The rest impressive, but the Legion is grateful most for restored leadership. It frees us to fight to the dark spawn properly. Um Can I count on you to fight the blight at my side? Nay. God damn our it. Place is down here. When you break the blight and you've got the skill, we'll make sure they have nowhere to retreat. Damn straight You'll you have will. us indirectly. That's more than any surfacer can say. Um, I need. Ooh. <laughs> I need you topside. Show the world your skill. You alone have the skill to back up your words. Yes! Each of the Legion owes our homeland a death, but if our lives are better shed on the surface. Each of so our homeland a death. Back to Orzammar wow. when we win, though. I'll not stay topside to lose my stone sense. <laughs> Yay, we have the Legion of the Dead! <laughs> News of the hour! All hail King Balin Iduken! The worthiest dwarf has ascended to the throne! Okay. 
nobody wants to say anything against Balin now. Oh boy. That's gonna come bite me in the ass in Inquisition. Hi, Helmy. How you doing? Why is Helmy wearing armor? I don't want to question it. Let's get the hell out of this place. Loading, loading. Oh, where's my book? Oh. How to Survive a Sharknado. Here we go. There's a book we can read. Uh, meteor Storm. While the meteoroids entering Earth's atmosphere during the meteor shower leave behind brilliant streaks of light, most are bigger, no bigger than grains of sand. Meteor storms, on the other hand, feature hefty rocks made of robust elements capable of passing through the atmosphere without burning up. There we go. A little bit of science for today from How to Survive a Sharknado. Oh, I have to go give the thing to the shaper. Right? I might, I might as well do that. Oh, and we still have to talk to. Oh, uh, um, uh, 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 hi, Filda. How are you? You've returned. Yes. With all the excitement over the new king, I never expected you to remember my um, poor son. Yeah. Did you learn anything about my ruck? Uh, about about ruck. Um. Lady, your son is done getting one. Oh my god. Yes, but you might not want to hear it. What is it? Is he dead? Oh, please don't torment me. No, give me the option to tell her that he's dead! I'm afraid Ruck went crazy after too long in the deep roads. Crazy? Oh, ancestors, save him. I've heard of this. Lost soldiers turning on each other, eating darkspawn flesh. Yep. Is that what happened to my boy? Why didn't you bring him home? Um... Um, Ruck didn't want you to see him like that. Such a good boy. Still thinking of me after all he's been through. I have to go to him. No, he needs no, me. honey, you're gonna die oh, if you do that. He's so frightened, mm -hmm. so lonely. Mm -hmm. I thank you for what you've done. Even if you couldn't be bothered with more. Take this. It's my husband's masterwork, the first shield he smithed. I was saving it for Ruck, but I want you to have it. As my thanks. <sighs> honey. Damn it! You're going to die. I'm going to find Ruck now. I know I can save him. No, you can't do shit. Ooh, wall carving. Wait, the shape in the other direction. Damn it! Why am I so bad at game? Wubba bow! We've got a lot of quests to turn in here, apparently. Uh, hi, Orta. We got a thing for you. There's a book over there I need to read. I started to worry. I didn't know if you were ever coming back. Of course I was. Did you find any records? Any sign of the old Orton Tig? Yeah, about that. <laughs> I have the records right here. You... you found them? Yep. Let me see. You are noble, honey buns. Have fun. That's my great-grandmother's name. And her husband! Oh, great ancestors, it's them! It's me! I am an Orton. Oh, thank you. I have to take these to the assembly right away. Find me there. Once these are acknowledged, I'll give you any reward. Oh, great. Now we're going to have to go to the assembly so we can then talk to her. Oh, book. Book. Oh! Level up from reading a book. No harm ever came from reading a book. Well, apparently not. Um, let's have some more decks. I really need more willpower. Let's, you know what? All of the willpower. Um... What's that? Use the phone. Yes. Okay then. So there's number one. Now we've got this one. Most impressive warden. King Balin's ascent to his father's throne has been recorded in the memories. Yay. Is there something more I can help you with? Yeah, I've got a, I've got something for you. Um, I have some tracing you might be interested in. What's this? A list of names. Most of these clans no longer even exist. Is this authentic? You bet your hairy arse it is. Taken from a tablet in Keridan's fortress, no less. Then is it true? Golems. It's the golems. The rumors of Keridan's so-called volunteers? Yep. Extraordinary. I would love to make a copy of this. The Shaperit has never had much information on Keridan and his golems, much less proof of this magnitude. Warden, I hope this artifact from our archives will suffice as a reward. I must inform the Shaperit at once. Ooh, he just gives me an artifact. Okay. What's this? Mm, she knows. 
Okay. I just got a massively itchy nose for a second. Hi, Orta! Yoink! My name's Orta. Cool. After the old Orton house. Yeah. They gave our seat back. And the records show which houses still owe House Orton money. One day, I will be able to properly thank you for all you've done for me. Aww. Um, your happiness is enough because I am Yue and I am. Goody freaking two shoes! And I don't know what treasure is left, but whatever I get, you can have as much as you want. I'll have to find someone willing to look. Maybe a whole expedition. If the taig is still there, it must have something. House Orton will not forget this kindness. <laughs> Didn't that sound House official? House Orton. Oh, honey. Oh, cast systems are still bad. Okay, now let's go all the way back to the party camp. Because we have Ogren to talk to. We have Shale to talk to. We need to switch Shale back into the party. And then we need to decide where to go from there. Since we have finished a whole section of the, of the game. Hour. Shut the up, Mr. Naysayer. It looks like it's about time for one of us, or for one of us, for me to do another DLC. I'm thinking that we are going to do the, um, oh, what's it called? Soldier's Peak? We did say that we'd have Mr. Leverage ride and didn't we? Yes, we did. And the fact that that place is pretty much loot heaven. And it has a place where I can put stuff so I don't have to carry it in my inventory anymore. Like the family sword. And shield. I mean, I didn't have to carry those. I could just sell them, but they're, they're, they're special. They're very special. Do, do, do. I don't know. Hello, Mr. Komana. Bye, Mr. Komana. Who's that? Who's that? It's a thing that I don't care about. Let's go through here. Hall of Heroes. <coughs> Is it gonna make me back all the way up? I probably could have just gone to the Deep Roads entrance and then used that as a weird conduit into Ferelden. But I just now thought of that. So never mind. Now that's a thing of Paragon Orton. Cool. Can I, can I get that? Can I get... Oh, hi, Ogren. Give me a moment. Why are you coming with me? You haven't said anything. Is everything all right? Of course everything's all right. Yeah. Uh, just give me one sodding moment. Why, the stone. I feel like I'm about to fall off the world with all that sky up there. Oh, he's never been on the surface. Um... We'll take your time, I need you ready to fight. If I could fight Randar Volney second after downing 15 lichen ales in half an hour, <laughs> I'm not gonna be put off by a high sodding ceiling. <laughs> high well, ceiling. Let's get moving. <laughs> We're losing, what you call it? Daylight. Aww, Ogren approves, yay. That's probably why it didn't want me to, um, so, uh, go into things. Yes? About those hunters from Oswin. Oh god damn it. Strung them up like foxes. He I did. was listening to Ogren, you son of a monkey's uncle. Oh well, we've got Orzmar on our side. Yay. Bounty hunter. Did I forget to loot someone? I forgot to loot someone. I forgot to loot someone else. I'm bad at that. Okay, now can we go? No. It's long path to the exit. Yay, world map! Let's go over to there. Party camp! Party rocking in the house tonight. Everybody just have a good time. I can't remember the words to this song. Hi, Puppins. Ogren. Ogren, where you at? 
Actually, let's do a couple other things first. Hi, dudes. Um, let's give some gems. Here, now we can give people all of our gems. Because <laughs> they're not too much useful for us, but they make the dwarves happy. And we want the dwarves happy. Turn in gems for the dwarves. Have all of the metal kites. Uh, turn gems for the dwarves. Amethyst. Take them all. And turn into gems for the dwarves. Take my two passes. And give some runes for the circle. Um, let's give them all the little runes, and then I will put a bunch of runes into my armors and stuff. Or my weapons. Then we'll give them the rest of them. <laughs> Take the journeymans. I don't think you can give them Grandmaster runes. I think that's a thing. Leave. We are better with every step you take. Cool. So, Ogren. No, not Liliana! You've seen. How did you get Liliana? I've touched Andras' ashes. Oh, hi, Liliana. I haven't talked to you about that, have I? The remains of the Maker's Chosen. You look so weird in HD. Um, how can something so mundane have power? Maybe it is belief and faith that imbues them with their power, or just maybe Andraste really was blessed by him. I do not know if I am worthy to look upon her. Well, I already did. <laughs> She's dead, it doesn't matter. Um, Andraste fought for everyone. She belongs to us all. Yes, of course, but it still is something to be in awe of. Yay! She teleported again. Okay. No! UA, stop walking! Damn it! My controller is still semi-broken. Hi, Ogren. Let's have a discussion. Come to talk to old Ogren, have you? Yep. Don't know why. Because you're funny. Um, I'd like to, more, I'd like to know more about you. What about? Um, are you sure you're fine with what happened with Bronca? Oh, sure. I'm fine with it. I mean, she was a real firebrand between the sheets. <laughs> but a bit soft in the skull, you know what I mean? Explains why she left, anyway. Um... And she wasn't that crazy when she left. <laughs> oh, you don't know her. She was cracked like a glass floor. Before she was a paragon, I mean. Uh, before After she was a paragon? That, she really fell apart. Oh dear, then why did she you marry her? She and flits about with that watered tart hespeth. What she got that I don't. Just the thought of the two of them uh, together, boobs? kissing and licking and... Oh, God damn it, Hogren. On the floor of the deep roads. <gasps> yeah, I'm, uh, I'm just gonna go back to the tent for a moment. <laughs> Excuse me. Ogren's gonna be in his bunk. <laughs> okay. With that lovely little, uh, bit, let's talk some more to Ogren. Pull up a drink, Warden. Join me in my sodding hole. Oh, great. Um, I like to remember about What about? about you. Um, how do you like the surface? It's sodding great. At first I was a little queasy with all that air, but with all that air? so much of it. No one has any idea who you are or what you're doing. And the ale, well, who'd have thought ale made with grain? <laughs> what did you guys make it with the down there? The surface there? is great. It's like a big bright world of filth without a ceiling. <laughs> a big bright My world kind of, of filth. <laughs> hey, Let's go find something to kill, huh? All this talk makes my hands twitchy. Okay. Well, that's enough for this video. In the next one, we will continue talking to Ogren. My name is Miss Scarlet Tanager, and I have been playing some Dragon Age Origins. See you all in the next video.